Commercial businesses choose their cleaning products based upon a value equation that balances effectiveness, price, labor savings, and ease of use. At these universities, we run three shifts. We have people that are 24 hours a day, seven days a week. When I'm looking for products to buy, it's a combination of price, effectiveness, as well as labor, because nowadays it's productivity. How many square feet can they clean in an hour? A restaurant like this, we've got slate floors, hardwood floors, marble countertops, stainless steel. So you have to have the right cleaners for the right materials or your restaurant can actually look worse. So it's this sort of issue between durability, cost, and effectiveness. Also, you have to make sure that it's easy to use. You're dealing with a lot of untrained employees, don't speak a lot of English. You know, they have to be able just to pick up a product. Oh, it's glass cleaner, boom, it's glass cleaner. Commercial businesses prefer concentrated products because they believe they are more cost-effective over the long term, they allow them to control dosage based upon need, and they last longer, reducing the need to restock. Most of our commercial products are in concentrate form, and then we have a little rack that that does a mix to make sure that it's at the right concentration levels for what we need it for. Just from a purchasing standpoint, it helps out because it's concentrated, they last a lot longer, I don't have to purchase them as often. With the commercial grade products, the, the good thing is that you can buy them in as a concentrate and that allows you to dilute those products to the dilution and the power that you need. The other reason is cost efficient. I can, I can buy one gallon of glass cleaner and it's gonna last me probably a couple of months. If I buy only one bottle of Windex, it will last me, what, a week? Commercial businesses prefer the ease of ordering and convenience of quick delivery provided by suppliers. I am the one who calls in to get all the cleaning supplies. Uh, I'm, I call in to our distributor and I pretty much just give him the rundown of what we need and he's not there and just leave a voicemail and they'll usually deliver it within a day. I think going through a supplier is just a lot easier. In terms of ordering, you know, I've done it directly through the phone so you can fax in the order. Or you could just bypass the actual person and just do it online yourself. So I've done both. And also they can get the product to me within 24 hours without me personally having to go out and buy the product and lug it into my car and bring it on the property, then expensing it and doing, going through all that. Commercial businesses favor the flexible payment options, including POs and invoicing, offered by their suppliers. Some of the advantages of going through a distributor versus going to a regular retail place are flexible payment terms, 30, 60, 90 day um, arrangements to make sure that uh, we can continue operations and still meet our obligations to whatever contractor that we, that we sign up with. When we 
purchase uh, from our distributors over the phone, I, I would say it's much easier. To they'll, they'll send the stuff and they'll just give us a packaging slip of what they sent us and then maybe two or three days later we'll get an invoice in the mail with a bill that we just write up and then I'll send it, give it to the accountant and he'll pay the, pay the bill the next time that he's in. Commercial businesses believe they get better pricing and value from their suppliers. When I'm buying supplies, I go to the suppliers because I truly feel the, the best pricing through the suppliers. I'm usually not buying onesie, twosie type items. That only happens if I really happen to run low or I need something on the spot. I'm usually buying cases at a time on a monthly basis. So I'm hoping that I'm buying a lot better price. Commercial businesses rely on their suppliers' representatives for product knowledge and to provide solutions for their tough cleaning challenges. I've been able to build this relationship with this guy who will do the research and try to determine what that product should be for this building. I could call him anytime and say, hey, can you do some research and try to find an environmentally friendly disinfectant? Oh, so that is something that, that they're looking at. Is that cheaper? Most of the reps that work, I can actually gain some knowledge from them and they can usually help me out a lot faster or know exactly what to do for a specific situation. It's incredibly important for somebody who knows uh, what, what we're doing here and what the hotel needs are.